Hi uh, guys, today's drill is gonna be a warm up drill. It's called a follow your pass drill. Real simple drill, real effective though. Uh, again, it's just a warm up drill, but there's a lot of teaching points that you can make out of this. So this would be good for actually the youngest possible ages, right up to pro hockey players. Uh, at the young ages, you're just um, trying to get used to passing the puck and getting their feet moving. The older ages, you're looking for a little bit of pace. Simple drill though. So here, all we're doing is this. Starting off in opposite corners, setting up, a, let's call these guys X's. From this end, we'll call them O's. It's just simply starting at the hash marks. Just hard pass, get to that line. Once this guy gets the puck, pass it, follow your pass through. You'll see that in the video. Um, the key elements of this though is, especially as you get older, is to get your feet moving a little bit to create some pace. And the importance of getting your feet moving is it shortens the distance as you're passing. And it, uh, it'll get your pass a little bit more zip to it, which is very important. The other thing you wanna make sure that you're doing here is using your backhand when you can. So especially with the older guys, using your backhand when you can and keeping your stick up the ice so you're not turned around. So you're always looking at in the offensive zone when you're doing that. So everything's done on the whistle and very simple drill. Watch the video, enjoy it, and you can make some uh, adoptions if you need to. Stick up the ice steady. Stick. Get on your back end, get on your back end. I wanted to get you guys moving a little bit before I talk to you. Some of the passes, like, it's hard to believe that you can mess up a follow your pass drill with an inaccurate pass. Do you agree? Yeah. If you can't pass, you can't play. You gotta be able to move your feet, make good passes, period. Okay, we got people standing still. You've gotta make that pass, but here's one of the problems, okay? Probably one out of four guys, when you're starting your drill, is you're starting your drill from a dead stop and you're trying to make a pass like, like this. Okay, what am I gonna tell you to do? Huh? Yeah, move your feet, why? Good things happen when you move your feet, bad things happen when you don't. And a simple drill like that. So just take, the, take that second to get your feet moving, shorten that gap, add some momentum to your passes and make them accurate. Secondly, when you're, when you're passing a puck, short and crisp, right? Hands are in front of you all the time. Don't wind up from here, that makes a heavy pass and it becomes a little bit more inaccurate. So as you're stepping into it, here you go. Your feet are moving and get your ass going, okay? Let's just do it a couple more times and we're done. On the tape. On the tape, Smitty! On the tape! On the tape, Greeny!